Howdy y'all, what up? Hoseman Mississippi here back with yet another video. Welcome back again to my channel. First of all, before I get started, the pantyhose I have on, these are Leg Sheer Energy Active Support Suntan Pantyhose. <laughs> uh, anyway, I know y'all read the title of this video, I'm sure, before you hit play on it. Now, and I also know you might be thinking, what the heck, has he been lying to us this whole time about having varicose veins? The answer to that is no, I have not lied about that. I do have varicose veins, as well as venous reflux in my legs, and I have been ordered by a doctor to wear supporting compression hosiery to treat it. Now, let me explain uh, what I mean by the title. Uh, of course, as y'all know, quite a few years ago is when I first had a Doppler scan done on my legs and was diagnosed with varicose veins and venous reflux. And also y'all know that last week I had the same thing done because the pain in my legs has been getting worse. Now I have not heard results back from uh, that scan yet. I've, I've, I've not heard results back from that yet. But when I was at that appointment and the technician was doing the scan on my legs, um, I had her to take the scan thingamajig and to scan these two lumps on my legs. Um, now, I know y'all can't see them from there, but I've showed y'all these lumps in previous videos, and it was hard to see them uh, when I wasn't wearing hosiery, but I have two identical lumps on both legs between my knees and my ankles, and those lumps are quite painful at times. Um, but I had her to put the scan thingamajig on these lumps, and when she did, she said that is not veins. She said these lumps are like a cyst or a tumor or something like that. So um, I'm going to need to get another appointment to get that looked at and, and find out exactly what it is and find out treatment options for it because it is painful. However, wearing support and compression hosiery also helps with the pain from these lumps, whatever the heck they are, cysts or tumors or whatever the heck they are. Wearing support and compression hosiery helps with that. Or helps with the pain from that. Um, but it is very true that I do have varicose veins and, and venous reflux. And I have a mild case of it, which, you know, uh, you know, I'm treating with supporting compression hosiery. Which I don't mind that at all. I love wearing pantyhose, as you all know. Um, and also, if I didn't have varicose veins, I would probably still be wearing pantyhose anyway. Because I've worn them for practically my whole life and I love wearing pantyhose. <laughs> but anyway, um, uh, of course that uh, is not going to require surgery. My veins, varicose veins, is not going to require surgery and hopefully it won't get to the point where it does. Uh, but I do want to get these lumps looked at and find out exactly what they are, like I said, and uh, get treatment options for that. Now, these lumps in my legs, cysts or tumors or whatever they are, uh, they did develop when I was still driving a truck. That's when I first noticed it, and that's when I said I need to get an appointment to have all this looked at. And so that's what I did, of course. Um, no, wait a minute, wait a minute. Uh, I'm sorry about that, y'all. A few years ago, before I started driving a truck, uh, the first time I was a security guard at the hospital, that's when I had the first appointment to get the scan done on my legs and found out I had varicose veins. Anyway, these lumps showed up, started showing up when I was still driving a truck. That's right. Okay, I think. That was a long time ago, if memory serves. Anyway, <laughs> um, I, I know, I, I am not lying to y'all about anything. I promise y'all that. It's just, it was a few years ago when I was first diagnosed with varicose veins and noticed these lumps in my legs. And, you know, sometimes I get a little confused as to exactly when it was done, you know. But anyway, I just wanted to share that with y'all, and I wanted y'all to know that, and that I have not lied about having varicose veins. And I'm about ready to wrap this video. I see that I uh, am still sitting at 597 subscribers, so to both my old and new subscribers, thank y'all so much for subscribing. Y'all freaking rock. Please keep it up. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, make sure you smash that subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you will know when I've uploaded a new video. Also, if you have any other questions, or if you have any questions for this month's Q&A video for me to, to answer later on in the month, 
please leave those in the comment section below and I will answer them in this month's Q&A video. But again, I will only answer the first five questions posted. And also, once again, please keep them appropriate, no fetish type questions. Those kinds of questions will get deleted. And if you have made it to the end of this video, thank you so much. Please comment below suntan, the color of pantyhose that I'm wearing. And the first person who does that, I will pin his or her comment to the top. And now that is going to wrap this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to give that like button a nice big click. And that's going to do it. As always, y'all, take care. Have a good one. God bless, and I will see you soon. Bye. And please, please keep in mind, men have freaking legs, too. <laughs> see y'all later.